All right, now we want to make sure that the player cannot shoot whenever the player is dead. So let's open the uh, player shoot script. Let's just look for it. Player shoot, there it is. I'm gonna double click on it to open it. And let's modify this. Now, if you take a look at it, we need to say that if it can shoot or not. And we do have is shooting, we have stop shooting, but we don't have can shoot. So we have to add this. Now, if the player is dead, we cannot shoot. So how do we know if the player is dead or not? We can check this out from the player's health. So we can access the player's health from the uh, player's health script. So let's make um, a reference to that script. Public, and then let's call it um, player's health. And let's call it health script. All right, now let's go in the start and initialize it health script is equal to get component and that would be the component player health there it is and that's it at this point we have the health script now in the update what we want to do is making sure that we can shoot so before even the command shoot we can uh, we can do it inside of the command shoot actually so that it uses both of them and here we can say um, if um, if the health, so that would be uh, the health script, health script dot, and we need something that uh, is is dead, or let's actually do current health. If the current health is less or equal to zero, then obviously the player is dead, so we cannot shoot. So we return. Okay. All right. So at this point, that would stop the player from shooting. That's good. And next thing we want to do is to make sure that the player dies in every places whenever um, in, in every client whenever it reaches zero health so let's edit the player's health script so select the player's health script and let's change the logic now if you look into take damage that's when we have the logic here that says if the current health is less recall than zero we die however we have an if statement that if it's not the server this does not get run so we have to remove this out okay all right, so let's go ahead and do that. And we, I'm just gonna take this and, and check this out. So I'm gonna remove that by cutting this, cut. And I'm gonna paste this inside of the, um, inside of the update. Okay, so right here, inside of the update, I put, if the current health is less or equal than zero, then play the death. However, what we want to do also is take the um, is dead, okay? so right here if is dead okay so i'm going to copy this comment x actually uh, we need that too so comment c and i'm going to put that right here right before because we don't want to run this so but the best way to do that we're going to say if if the player is not dead then we run this all right and that's it so at this point we have everything set up so that the player when the player is dead we can actually stop it right there and if the player um, if the player is dead, we cannot shoot anymore. Let's give it a shot and try this out. All right, so we have two games running, and I'm going to go with the left uh, the left side. So I'm controlling the uh, purple character, and I'm going to kill the uh, yellow or red character. All right, so I'm going to shoot, and as you can see, the bar is going down, and there we go. We have the death on both sides all right so right here is dead and right here is dead as well now i can still rotate it so i'm gonna have to fix that right but i can't shoot i'm trying to shoot i can't shoot from the, the character but i can still shoot from this one okay so so far so good i just need now to modify the transforms as well